What is going on you guys? Today is going to be a quick video of just something I wanted to try out. Um, a lot of you guys probably have seen Stang Mode's video with the 2019-2018 Mustangs and the engine ticking. He used something called Ceratec. Uh, I actually picked up a bottle of Ceratec on Amazon. It cost me like $25. And so we're actually going to try this out to see if it actually works. I'm a little skeptical. I'm not too sure if it's actually going to work or not. Um, my ticking is kind of hard to hear and it happens It happens at weird times. Sometimes it'll be once the engine warms up, it'll start and then stop and then start. And I don't know. Um, I know it's not the fuel injectors because that you could hear constantly. That I'm not worried about. The ticking, it comes and goes, so I'm not really too sure how I would describe as to when I could get it to happen. But let's go ahead and get a cold start. Let's get this thing warmed up and then we could add that in. Uh, we could add in our Ceratec. Get a nice cold start here. We're gonna wait for that guy to warm up. Once we get it to operating temperature, it's in at 85 degrees right now. So, once we get it warmed up a little bit, we'll go ahead and add the Ceratec. All right, so we got the engine up to temp. Let me see if I could show you guys or have you guys have a listen. Here you can hear the engine up top. It's really hard to hear up here, so I'm not worried about that. If you go underneath here, I actually can't hear it right now. Let me go to the other side. You can hear it on this side here. And I'm not talking about the fuel injectors. So let's go ahead, bleh. let's go ahead, turn off the engine, add in our Ceratec and let's see what happens. So you have our one bottle of Ceratec here. Let's see, take off that little top right there. Ooh, it does not smell good at all. So the instructions for it say add directly to motor, let's see. Add directly to motor transmission oil, preferably right after an oil change. We just did our oil change yesterday. Um, continue, shake well before use. So let's go ahead and shake it up well. Alright, so we just added in both bottles of our Ceratec. Let's go ahead and take this one out here. Perfect. I'll set that guy down there. Let's put the cap back on. Put that there. Now we will put back on our oil cap. Just like so. Let's put these guys into the recycling now. And let's go ahead and turn on our engine and let's see if we notice a difference here. As you can see, our engine is up to temp there. Waiting for our end gauge to turn on. Wait a second. I hear the fuel injectors. Let's let it run for a little bit. I don't know if it's a mental thing that I'm just telling myself I can't hear it. But let's give it let's give it a little bit. 
So you can hear the fuel, I don't know if you can hear it, but the fuel injectors are extremely loud from the top of the engine here. Yeah, I'm not too sure if you guys can actually hear it because the engine itself is so loud. All right, idle just dropped. Yeah, let's see. I can't hear anything. Wait a second. I think we would call this a success. I can't tell if it's me making up my head. We'll hear it on camera, obviously. But I don't hear that anymore. Hmm. Well, the real test is we're going to West Palm uh, cars and coffee this weekend. I'm actually leaving in a few hours, so I will be recording all that there. We're going to test it out. We have about 250 miles, I think it is. Something like how long it's going to be for us to drive because we're coming from Orlando. So that's going to be the real test for when we get to West Palm if we still have that engine ticker there or not. That's going to be it for today's video, guys. Doesn't she look mean? Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm going to go ahead and link the Saratech down in the, the description below. So if you guys want to check it out and you guys want to get some for yourselves, feel free to do so. But feel free to like and subscribe. I'll see you guys next time. Like always, drop a comment if you have any questions. And thanks for watching.